Hello guys, welcome to this channel. In this video, you will see Toya Johnson rushing at the screening of Tyler Perry's new documentary, Maxine's Baby, as well as a short speech by him after the screening. So let's get to it. You think you know someone, and then your beautiful team make a piece like this, and you had no, we had no idea. We had no idea. Some things were public, some things weren't. But the honesty in the storytelling is unbelievable. And I just need to know, how do you really feel about it? <laughs> you like that? The fir first off, I'll say that there was no one that I would have trusted more than this woman. She brought him along to do it because, you know, 10 years, camera in your face, I'm like, you don't get out of my face with this camera. But, <laughs> but I knew she would do an incredible job. I knew Armani would do an incredible job. Her, her passion, her compassion for humanity, for life. She's just a beautiful, wonderful soul. And to, to I couldn't have even Listen, I wouldn't have a kid. I wouldn't even take it a chance. <laughs> so, but, but with all of that said, the, the, um, it's hard to watch. That's why I missed most of it, because I watched it. They had complete creative control. I watched it at the very end. I come in bits and pieces, because it's not a movie that I wrote where I'm talking about Hello. It's actually me walking through my life, which is very difficult. But I could not be more proud of you and of you you guys did a fantastic job, and I want nothing but the best for you. So that's the only question I'm going to answer. That's so fine. Say, that's all we need. I do want to say thank you. And Atlanta, thank you for showing me that this is the black mecca. We can do it all. And if anything in this doc, the only reason to do this, the only reason to have cameras follow me this much and be this much in my life by our son is so important to us. We try desperately to keep him private so he knows who he is before people start to tell him who he is. The beauty of all of that and being in Atlanta is that I got a chance to let them tell this story and it inspires. Mm -hmm. If it didn't inspire, there's no reason to do it. Yeah, yeah. So I hope you're inspired. I hope you're encouraged. I still don't say this. I said last week. When I left Oprah's house, when I left Oprah's house after the Legends Ball, I left her saying, "I'm going to dream bigger," because I saw something that inspired me. I saw something that motivated me. We overcome by the words of the testimony of someone else. These are the words of my testimony. This is my mother's story. So I hope that when you see it, it makes you know that you can go beyond any dream you've ever imagined. There was no reason for this to happen to for me, to me, other than through the grace of God. So God bless you. I'm done. Y'all finish your interview. I love you. Make some noise for Tyler Perry!